Yo, what's up, family? It's it's your brother from the same original mother, Mr. X. It's been a long day um, today. I'm still in Baltimore. I got one last thing. I just want to share some stuff with y'all. So I'm right by that CVS on uh, in no on North and Penn. So I wasn't out here. I wasn't here during the what happened. But I spoke with a lot of people today. I spoke with kids. I spoke with adults. I spoke with so many people today. And uh, so they gave me the scenery. I checked out. I was just talking to so many people. Like That's what I do for a living anyway. Um, but so I'm going to show. I'm going to go. So I'm walking over here, right? And so where I'm standing, I'm standing on Pennsylvania Avenue, right? Right where that truck is, uh, that's where uh, Bull who got maced, all right, where that bus is passing, Bull who got maced right in his face and they dragged him. It was uh, right there. So there's here's the CVS, right? And then there's a back parking lot alley at the CVS. And then this is Pennsylvania Avenue. So I was told that they had this whole Pennsylvania Avenue blocked off, right? This CV, the, up to that red light, everything back here was nothing but police. Nothing but police officers. This is where they. This is where they set up their shop, all up and back through uh, behind here. And so, I heard multiple people. They were saying that the media, you know, keeps lying. The 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 masses of people before this fire started was a mile up that way. This is the only one of the only like well known or like national places that's like really in this area like within blocks and blocks i don't see any mcdonald's i don't see any fast food i don't see anything this cvs cvs is the only thing that people can or that uh a lot of people can relate to it's not the only thing but there's a beauty mart right on the side if they say beauty mart got burnt down no one cares beauty mart right so i, I showed in a different video miseducation our cities our city and state leader are not for our kids lives right freddie gray police go home right because this is where they all all were at and i was told by plenty of people i was told by multiple people that the police actually started this fire the only because i'm i came here because the way the media portrayed it it made it seem like hell of shit was our hell of shit was on fire. They're burning up everything. You feel me? Like they they're showing propaganda uh, in in Europe of Baltimore. Or it's not even pictures of Baltimore. It's pictures of whole cities in flames, like a Venezuela riot. Uh, even Fox in America showed that picture. So they said that the police started this fire here, so they can set up shop. If I walk up that street right there, where I was earlier, nothing but, you know, it's like Hustlers Avenue, basically. Dudes clearly uh, posted up on the block, selling drugs or Lucy's, whatever they got to do to uh, survive. And then the train station right here. So just visualize this. The police set up, this is their camp. No one can come in from that way. And they... They got this whole this whole area. Obviously, uh, we know the history of we know the history of agents. Let's not put it past let's not put it past the power structure, because they demolished their their own countries. I mean, their own like two thousand their own two thousand of their own citizens in, in two thousand one. Like, not just the two. Twin Towers collapsed, but like four other buildings did as well. And there's some very, very, very important, powerful, influential people uh, in there. It's the World Trade Center. The plane hits the top of it, and then all of a sudden, people who are actually there, they hear bombs, uh, second bombs, and then boom, it, the, it, the buildings fall like a demolition. Go Type in YouTube, the uh, de demolition on... on the demolition of a building and uh, and then look how the September 11th towers fell 
you'll see the same thing will look the exact same. So if they'll do that, I know for a fact they'll set the, that, that little shit on fire it's because they need a story. They can't have 10,000 10, peaceful black protesters. Hell no, nah, they got to start something because they know that these young cats are sheep as well. So once they see a couple people doing it, everyone does it. But just think about how many black people go to jail or, in, uh, or are in jail right now for arson. How many people, black people go to jail a year for arson? Do black people burn shit down? Is that what we do? Because I know groups of people who, I mean, just after losing a sports game, they setting people's cars on fire. You feel me? They're flipping over cars. They're doing hella crazy stuff. College educated, so-called civilized white people fuck up the whole entire city after losing a sports game. Hell of shit on fire. It's all, oh, and they're just rowdy kids, I guess, or even adults. They're just... But, come on, you guys. I mean, it's CVS right there. It's the only thing that's burnt. CVS is the only thing that's burnt at all, period. <laughs>